Hey guys, what's happening? So in my last video, I showed you my front chip containment system for this 318 CNC. Um, sorry for the background noise. I'm printing out a new uh, electronics box for the uh, MKS DLC. It's going to go right here with the uh, MOSFETs. But this video is about my rear chip containment system. Alright, so I can actually maintain the chip in the back here. And it's actually four different parts, or five if you actually want to use the air system. So if you wanted to actually use like a my air system, air you know, mist system up here. You know, all, all my stuff is on my thing wrist page, all the stuff I designed. Um, Alright, so it consists of four different pieces. And so you have your two back covers. And these little four holes right here are for the uh, to mount this thing right here. The, uh, the water bottle air system here. All right, and it has these two pillars that go like this. Slide into this thing like that and mount here and here. So I was hoping this would actually give extra stability for this pillar. It mounts here and mounts there. So one on each side, two of those. Go like that and that. And one of the weird things about this I gave it some overhang like that so you wouldn't allow chips to get through. But one of the issues with these with these 38 C or 3018 CNCs is the bed actually goes over the back extruder motor. So I had to create a system that kind of like came out and I have this notch which is goes like this. But at the same time it needed to come over to prevent the chips from you know, at least uh, preventing the chips from getting under, under the uh, thing here. So, just screws here with some M3s. So I'll show you when I'm done with it. But hopefully that will keep the chips contained. Alright, so these two parts are designed to go together. My 3D printer just can't print out one piece, so I had to make it two pieces. So, a couple M3 nuts. M3 uh, screws here. So originally I had it down here, but on my new version, I actually brought it up to the top. So I was hoping to be able to contain more of the stuff, so the, the debris. All right, so if you didn't see my, one of my other videos, I actually designed a, uh, a coolant system, coolant and air system, that's gonna feed this right here on the top. So I have the air inlet, water bottle, or coolant bottle. So that's gonna be going on the back here. And I also created a whole nother uh, containment box dual MOSFET box for the uh, MKS DLC 2.0, but I'll show you another video about that. Hey, to make this easier, I put this on my, uh, I cut off a little Allen, and hey, there it is, rear containment system. So, if you're new to this channel, then the whole concept here was to be able to actually pull the chips out of the front is to blow the chips down to the bottom. There's a catch, catch tray at the bottom. And just pull that out, get the chips out. All right, so I'm not gonna be using that, the stock electronics, the woodpecker box. Uh, in another video, I'll show you what I'm doing here with this uh, MKS DLC 2.0, my dual MOSFETs. And actually, I need the MOSFETs to be able to control the air. I wanna be able to control the air from, uh, from gerbil, from software, M8, 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 M9 commands. So that's gonna go there. I'm actually printing out the top right now, the channeled air top. I'll show you that in my upcoming video. But, cool. So I mean, at this point, I can actually start using this thing. I mean, I've used it a little bit, but, you know, um, yeah, I mean, my goal is to be able to cut aluminum with this thing. Or at least get it to the point where it can actually cut aluminum, or I mean, wood, I guess, but, kinda hook the lights up. But, all right, cool, done with the containment system. So once I have an operational, I'll come back and make an air video of the whole thing actually being used. But put this down, link down below on my Thingiverse page, so if you want. And now I'm done with the complete containment system. So I have the bottom, the rear, the, the front, the back. Design this, design that. All right, cool.